December 6th, Wednesday. We've actually got three parts of today's workout and that's what the next couple Wednesdays are gonna look like. We've got some hinging endurance and hinging strength work. Starts off with building up to a heavy single and the heavy single today is just gonna be about 80%. We have not tested our one rep max deadlift in a very long time. Some of you guys that are following Black Sheep Training might have in the past, or if you're just kind of messing around, you might have. What we're gonna do, it, as far as the notes underneath this video and in the notes of the workout, we're gonna put a couple other one rep max numbers that could create correlation between your one rep max deadlift and what 80% of that might be. If you know what your back squat is, if you know what your front squat is, if you know what your power clean is or your power snatch is, you might be able to fill in the gaps and know what a rough estimation of what your deadlift is so that you can pull 80% of that rough estimation for this heavy single today. If none of that's gonna apply to you, consider 80% to be like an eight of 10 RPE, right? You can add weight if you had to, you're not today. Generally speaking at 80%, the bar speed tends to slow down significantly. Um, but again, you've got plenty of room to build. Once we've hit that 80%, we're gonna back off to 70 to 75% and do a little EMOM where we're gonna work on some speed and some power as far as, far as the hinging movement goes. And then our Wednesday template for the next four weeks is gonna be dumbbell sets, rounds for time. So today we got 16 alternating dumbbell hang clean and jerks, uh, toes to bar and wall climbs. The open has shown that they like, you know, CrossFit has shown that they like dumbbell work um, and dumbbell work specifically coupled with gymnastic stuff. So Wednesdays are gonna be our day that we're gonna get exposure to that. So that leading into the open, we're gonna feel as good as possible.